What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. I am coming to y'all today to show you, to talk to y'all for one. I got Nibby over to sleep, so <clears throat> try to be quiet, y'all. I'm going to try to be quiet. But I, it's, it's wash day, y'all. It is wash to the day, okay? So I'm just coming to y'all to talk to y'all for a minute. So I'm going to plait my hair up in some sections or maybe braid my hair up in some sections. Yeah, how about I braid it up in some sections? And um, because I'm going to wash it while it's braided. That's hopefully that's going to be easier for me. Now, I used to, when I was on my growing phase a long time ago, I used to wash my hair braided up all the time. And it worked out really well like that. But I don't know about this time. I, I can probably get away with washing it just like this. But... I'm going to try this braided up way first. Yeah, Christmas was a lot for me. I ain't had no toys like everywhere. Well, there ain't been no toys everywhere. I ain't had no toys around since Nibby left the last time. So it was kind of like, ugh. So I'm going to braid my hair. And I'm going to try to braid it back further. So when I do wash my hair, that I can get, get my edges a little bit good. A little bit good. A lot good. But it's a lot of product in my hair, from the virgin hair fertilizer to uh, the even edge control to all the moisturizing I've been doing, the S curl spray and all of that. But hopefully my shampoo can get like good on my hair, on my edges and in my hair, in the braid part. So I'm just going to do it like this and this will help me to uh, have less tangles. Because so, when I wash my hair, y'all, my whole my whole head just be a big tangly mess, and then I gotta figure out how I'm gonna detangle my hair, and I hate that. I hate that. So washing my hair this way saves me a lot of stress on the extra tangles and detangling my hair, um, because it'll already be in my sections after I get done washing it. So all I have to do is. Um, detangle that specific section. How many of y'all been watching me long enough to that done seen me wash my hair like this before? That's what I want to know. This, this look. I'm gonna double it since they're so small. I'm gonna double it and see how that's gonna work. Maybe okay. If I double it, then I do it four times. Yes. So. Yeah, I'm going to do all of my hair like this, and then I'm going to shampoo my hair, and um, I'm going to be, uh, hopefully that's going to work real good now. My hair is a lot thicker this go round than when I, when it, when it used, when I used to do it, it was, it's thicker this time because I think because I cut the ends off. I don't know, I guess, but it's, it feels a whole lot. Yeah, I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos, and I've been trying to come up with a master plan on how to make some extra money, and, you know, it, it, everything ain't for everybody. You know, everything, every time somebody makes some money, it ain't for, every way somebody make money ain't for everybody. So I've been trying to figure out my own way, and I figure, man, I do so much on my YouTube channel, and this channel, for real, for real, is failing. It's failing to me. It's failing because I have 50 uh, plus 53,000 subscribers and only can get max, seems like max, unless I do a council update video, I can get 400 views out of 53,000 of people that are actually subscribed to my channel, man. And it's, that sucks. That's a heartbreak. Like, in itself, that's a heartbreak. I don't care what nobody say. I don't care how many times somebody say, be strong, don't quit, you can do it. Yeah. <laughs> it ain't happening. It ain't happening. I tried all 2018 for my videos to, like, get better views and all of that, you know. But I actually, I see the only way that I'm going to get a YouTube check, <laughs> a actual meet the threshold, is I got to post every day. If I miss a day, I'm going to miss a threshold. I'm for real. Like, it sucks, but... People think because people think because you YouTubers you make a lot of money or whatever, but you don't. Well, not me. Some of YouTubers, a lot of YouTubers do make a lot of money. I'm gonna tell y'all this: if you get, if you got a YouTuber that posts videos every day and can get at least a thousand views per video, then that YouTuber is doing okay. Okay, if you can, if you can get at least a thousand per video. 
that that YouTuber and, and most of the people who watch the video all the way through can get at least 500 a month. I can't get that because I can't even get a thousand videos per video. On, only time I get like high views on my video is if I'm talking about my cancer update. And like I feel like, okay, that's cool. A lot of people come in to check on me. But I only do a cancer update every three months, you know. But other than that, nobody don't really show me love. I mean, y'all show me love, but I don't get enough people to show me love. So that's why I have to struggle and make bonnets and try to do what I got to do. But I'm, I'm really, really, I'm going to be honest with y'all, trying to make it. Uh, financially is a struggle here for me now. I need to find a way like, cause listen I'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all cause at this point I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired I wanna get out of this house because it's driving me nuts like seriously, driving me nuts. This would be a good braid out pattern y'all, what y'all think? Like, when I do, do my braid out again, or last time I tried to do a twist out I ain't doing that no more because that was too complicated. It took me forever. I could do this right here and, and be done with it, right? <laughs> Girl, let me find out. Let me find out that it will be a bomb twist out, braid out, whatever this is. Braid out, y'all. So, yeah. Anyway, what I was talking about. Yeah, so, I'm tired, y'all. I'm ready to get out of this house. I'm tired of these damn kids. Like, for real. I'm tired of all of them. Well, self was scooby. But I'm tired of all of the rest of them. You know my damn nerves. Wrong here, happy babies coming back home. I'm just stop, leave me alone, let me live. It's, I'm tired, you know. I'm tired, go on, go on, be on your own, and leave me the hell alone for real. I said what I said, <laughs> so I'm going to part this one. This one ain't kind of hard, y'all. And yeah, I'm ready to live now. I'm 41 years old, I'm 41 years old, and life don't get any. You know, it don't get any faster or slower or shorter or something. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I've done it. I think I've, I've overcome enough obstacles in my life for people to leave me the hell alone by now. You feel me? Um. So it's just that yeah, I'm tired. I need friends now. I'm now I'm at the point that okay. Remember I said I want to find me some friends. And but then I don't like friends. No, I like friends. I like everybody. I don't give a damn. I want friends. I don't care if they ratchet, whatever. <laughs> Send them my way, and I can feel to them about myself. If I got to slap the shit out of one of them, then that's what I'm going to have to do, okay? So, <laughs> anybody, it's fair game now because I'm tired. You know, I've been in Alabama for, I've been in Alabama since 2015. It's about to be 2019, y'all, and I still have yet to find a friend. Even though I try, I try to reach out to people, and it's just not working. So, I'm like, okay, what do I do next? <laughs> now, and I ain't talking about no long-distance relationships. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about some people that's close that I could go meet up with, and we could chill. But I know ain't nobody but ragamuffins. There ain't but too many ragamuffins in Montgomery. And then there's a lot of people who don't like, you know, I need people who like what I like. You know, because it's going to be summertime, and I'm going to get 2019 fine and play with it if you want to, because I am. Because I'm tired of sitting here. I'm tired of, okay, I'm hurting, I'm hurting, I'm hurting. I'm going to push through that hurt, and I'm going to just dive in what I need to dive in with my life. Because if I don't live my life, I'm going to have, I'm going to be miserable, you know. What's the point of living if when you die, you ain't got no proof of when you lived, you know? What's the point? Because when, when one day, everybody going to die. So when you die, do you want to, you want people to remember you or not remember you? Or you just good, you just good just being dead? I ain't good with just being dead. I want, I want, I want people to say, oh yeah, she had so much fun. I want y'all to look back on pictures of me and not sit in this damn YouTube room and me out being adventurous and laughing. Oh, hang time, <laughs> laughing, having fun, and all of that type of stuff. You know, I want that double this here thing. You know, I want that. I mean, I ain't trying to die, but I'm just saying. You know, I don't want that. I don't want that. But, um, I just want, I'm tired, y'all. At some point, you just tired. 
Like, the only thing that gives me life right now is Nivea, because she keep me on my toes. Get on my nerves, keep me on my toes. She's a baby, and I can accept all of her foolishness. But I don't want to accept grown folk foolishness. I don't want to accept none of that. And, um... I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm, I'm seriously going to have like meetup groups. I'm scared of people because people be stalking and stuff. I don't, I was on, I, my braids is so thick. Look at these doodle braids. How about it? What a relaxer girl. Well, it takes like, okay. <laughs> but still, my braids feel so good and juicy. So, they, they just, little do they know they finna get soaked up in water. Little do they know. Yes, honey. So, I'm gonna braid all this one side. Y'all, how y'all feel about that? How, how many of y'all out there, like, got some real friends that you can call and y'all could talk to? Not just call. I don't want to be no phone call chick, okay? I'm tired. I'm tired of the, the, okay, I got friends that I can hit up through messages. No, I need to go to your house and we need to kick it or whatever. We can go to bathroom by the roof together or whatever, you know? Some stuff like that. Yeah, not just I got some friends that I kick it with back in Florida. It's been long enough and I need to branch out, get myself together, and live my life. And I don't need no old people to be my friends because it seems like in Alabama, only the old folk around here got some manners and some respect. The rest of these young folk is just ignorant that I done seen. Uh, they don't got no life themselves. You know, you live right here in your city where you from and you know these folk. And you still sitting in the house ain't doing that? I mean, we ain't got to go to the club or whatever. We ain't got to go get crunk and drunk and, and all of that stuff. But I'm tired, y'all. Sitting here like this. And I need somebody on my level and in my mental level because sometimes I'm crazy as hell. <laughs> so I need somebody to balance me out, you know. Balance me out and not no drinking, no smoking. I can't deal. And, you know, just somebody who happy. I mean, I ain't looking for no friend like that, but eventually, I'm saying, I ain't, I'm not soliciting myself for a friend, but I am going to get out more, and I'm going to meet people, okay? You know, because internet, internet is not the same as somebody to talk to one-on-one, -on -one and somebody to laugh with, and somebody to joke with, and whatever, somebody to argue with, whatever friends may be, child. But it's not the same. You know, and I'm tired. Uh, I'm getting old now. I'm tired of playing. Like, how? how? <laughs> I'm just going to die with no friends? No, <laughs> it's not going to happen. I mean, I know I keep saying this, but no. I mean, you just can't live without nobody in your life. I mean, I know family. I got family, but family is family. They're going to always be there, and that's just, that's, that's by blood. But a real, real true life friend. Y'all, look at these breads. I mean, it ain't got to be no friend. I need some associates. You know, some associates, y'all. Some associates. I'm going to get out, reach out, find me some associates. So I won't call them friends because it takes a lot to be considered as a friend for me especially. And, oh, this hair so thick. And, oh, my God. Can y'all see the thickness in this hair, y'all? It may be because it's full of grease, too, because I've been wild, uh, what you call that? Virgin hair fertilizer in my hair up some, y'all. So... Oof. So I am, this is what I do, what I'm going to do. I'm, yeah, I think I'm just going to start doing my hair just because it just feel like it's just going to be so much easier so the water can just run through my hair and then I ain't got to worry about it, okay? So I'm going to turn that and continue on this process. Yeah, y'all, I can't wait to wash my hair. It has been, ooh, y'all, it has been... Four weeks since I washed my hair. I usually try to get it in every two to four weeks. Actually, it probably been longer than that, y'all, for real. I don't remember. But it's been a while. And I got some new products I'm going to show y'all. I can't wait to show y'all my new stuff. Because Sally's had this sale. Sally's had a good sale, y'all, for Christmas and stuff. They had a real good sale. And um, I was able to take part in it. Can y'all see? Y'all look. Look at my hands. Remember, I used to have, like, a lot of problems with braid in my hair and stuff like that. It's getting a lot better. It's getting a lot better. I still have problems with my hands, but they are better than they was uh, before, better than they used to be. 
So praise God for that. It's times that I still wear my gloves. Like, it's a lot of times that I still wear my gloves. I just don't wear them on camera no more because they look stupid. But off camera, I have my gloves on a lot. <laughs> y'all know my little uh, neuropathy gloves I have. But, yes, y'all. And when, when you braiding your hair to wash your hair, um, gotta kind of braid it tight a little bit. Not too tight, but try to I try to get it firm enough where... Um, it won't come loose because when you wet it with that water, that water just makes it. You know how water makes stuff loose. So, if it, if your braid not if your braid like loose, the water gonna make it like a little bit more difficult because it's gonna make your hair looser than already is. And if you get it looser than loose, then it might come loose, and then it'll be a little bit more difficult to deal with. Than it to just be that. So, yes, y'all. These are some juicy feeling braids. I am loving this feel of my hair like this, y'all. I might just wear my hair like this and we just gonna bring this style back for the 99 and 2000. Hey, it's gonna be 2019, baby. We had to bring some stuff back, y'all, because they done took all the good stuff away from these years. We need to put some of this stuff back in when we had. Y'all, if y'all ever see, like, pieces of glitter in my hair, on my face, on my skin, just know <laughs> that the chair that I sit in on a daily and record videos for y'all, which is this one, is glitter chair. My headboard on my bed is a glitter just like the chair, and I have another chair that's glitter. So if you see these big specks of glitter on me, that's where it's from. Sometimes I be watching videos, I be seeing little dots on my neck, I be like, child, what is that on my neck? And I don't see it till the video over, but whatever. Um, it's from my bed. So, I don't know. I like that the fabric when... I had it on me, but it's not no the glitter that stay on. It's that big sequence fabric. It's like sequence glitter. And it comes off. I didn't know that, but hey, it's on it now. I'm going to change my my whole bedroom scheme and all of that. Um, after a while, I'm going to change that. So, yeah, y'all, I'm trying to, I'm going to start getting out and I'm going to do more videos. I well, can't wait till I get me a vlog camera, y'all. I just, I can't wait till the Lord bless me so I can have money to get a vlog camera. A vlog camera costs like 600 It's like $575 or something like that. Like $600 pretty much. So, one day, I'm going to get a vlog camera. And one day, I'm going to be like a real big, big YouTuber that make a lot of money off my videos. <laughs> Go on speaking into existence, gold my girl. You better talk it. Walk it like you talk it. Okay, so, yeah, and I'm going to get me a vlog camera, and then I'm going to show more of my life and more of how I live my life and more how my life is lived and just more of me. And y'all going to get more of me because, you know what, I know, um... I be seeing, I be watching a lot of YouTube videos, and a lot of these YouTubers, like, show a lot of these self, but it's fun. Once you get in to vlogging and stuff it is a lot of fun it makes you feel good and it, it's just something if you a person that likes to record stuff then it is just fun for you so it's not like you you working is it a piece of it's a piece of glitter in my braid when i thought i took the glitter out of my hair and i'm trying to get the glitter out of my dog on hair oh my god yeah i can see it in there it's like stuck in between my braid the glitter won't let me be great today, y'all. So, my next video after this will be a wash video. I think I got a piece of glitter. Right, child, I don't know. But, look at that. Girl, you better come through with these braids. I ain't see my hair stretched in a minute, y'all. So, not stretch, stretch. I mean, it be poofy and all kind of other stuff. But, anyways, y'all, I'm going to be back when I get my whole head braided. I just want to talk to y'all. Sometimes I be frustrated about things and I just be wanting to talk, you know. I just be wanting to talk. Yeah, so yeah, they say, you know, it ain't good to find friends at an at old age. Honey, please. I'm going, some one of these days, the Lord going to send me a good friend. Just the same way he saw, sent me a husband, he can send me a friend too. And the Lord sent me a husband way from the other side of my world. So I know if he can send me a husband, he can send me a friend. My husband ain't my friend, you know. I mean, we friends, but I ain't talking about it like that. My husband don't want to go to the bathroom about it works. My husband don't want to do stuff that I want to do. That ain't, that ain't how we roll. A girl always need a girl in her life, okay? 
ain't got no I ain't talking about no sisters or whatever. I mean, if I had my sisters here, then that'd be cool, but they live everywhere else. So let me finish braiding these last two braids, y'all, and I will be back. I will be back after that, okay? Okay, y'all, so my hair is all braided up. All braided up. I hardly lost any hair from combing through my hair. And it been in a barn for like, I ain't combed it. Golly, two weeks? This is all I lost. This is it. Oh, well, that ain't it. That's some lint from the comb or somewhere. But this is it. That's it, y'all. Oh, how about that? Yes, that's keep that's from keeping my hair moisturized and sealed and wear my bonnets pretty much all the time unless I'm going somewhere I have my bonnet on. If I know I'm finna sit around and watch TV or sit around in the chair, my head gonna be rubbing in the chair on the bed and play with Neil, but you know, we in there watching TV with my husband or whatever. I have my bonnet on. And it protects my hair. Yes, honey. Come through bonnets. Ow. So um, you guys, the next video I upload should be a wash day video unless I feel like doing something in between. I am going to try to start posting more videos, y'all, so stay tuned. And I, when I say more, I mean more than just one a day. We're going to see how that right. We're going to see how that work, okay? And um, stay tuned to my channel. Okay, guys. Now, oh, let me turn around. I got to turn around for y'all. See? Y'all let me, y'all think that'll be a good braid out? Like, for real? Do you really? Do you? Do you really? So, I am going to be washing my hair after this. So, stay tuned to the next video, okay? Bam!